My eldest daughter was diagnosed when she was 18 months old and I'd never even heard of cystic fibrosis before, didn't know what it was. CF causes sticky mucus throughout the body. In particular, the respiratory system, so the lungs, become clogged with sticky mucus. Then it becomes infected and then we get damage, which is uh, long-term progressive damage to the lungs. So respiratory physio is designed to try to shake the lungs up and get this mucus to move around so we can then get medicines down to the parts of the lungs which may be infected. Um, she's taking around 150 tablets a week at the moment. You have to kind of have a, a marathon mentality around doing this because it's the long-term progression of uh, damage to the lungs that we're trying to prevent. A 12-year-old, a 10-year-old, a 5-year-old doesn't have any concept of that and, and why would they? This is, is one of the OPEP devices that she uses. This particular device generates 180 opportunities for me and my daughter to have an argument every day because that's the number of blows she has to do. The amount of arguing and fighting that we were experiencing every day, twice a day, was becoming intolerable. That's really the point where I felt I had to do something to try and sort this out. As a product designer, I sort of put that hat on and thought, what we need is some sort of electronic gizmo that would allow us to check that she was doing the physio properly. We would spend maybe on a good day, 20 minutes doing a physio session. Using the games that we're developing in the app, then she might take six to eight minutes. In the big picture, we're potentially talking about almost a month saved every year in working days of not doing treatment. Initially, I took the uh, prototypes in to see the respiratory team at Addenbrooke's. They pointed me towards ACT to suggest that there was a potential uh, grant that we could maybe go for and that, that might fund us with uh, some, some budget to actually spread this out to other families. William is a nine and a half year old who is like every other nine and a half year old around her. However, he happens to have cystic fibrosis. He um, is incredibly endearing, charismatic, outgoing. He loves life with a huge passion. When you have a young child doing physio every day, it becomes a daily battle, both morning and evening. And to suddenly have a prototype where your child rushes down and actually asks you if they can start physio, I mean, made a massive difference to all of our lives, really. The daily battles and arguments about physio just disappeared. The hardest and most difficult thing about CF is probably physio. Most people find it boring and repetitive, and let's face it, I do as well. We were one of the nine lucky families to check out the new app for physio. Basically, it had these really fun games like Space Invaders. It was like hiding physio in a video game. First of all, when I tried it, um, I thought that it was just going to be a boring old physio thing again, but I found it pretty fun. And I was really surprised to find out that my breathing was actually doing pretty well and that I wasn't doing this well enough in my usual physio, but I was in this. When I had to give the app back, well, in a way, I was kind of heartbroken. 